Do we want to talk to people, or do we want to just further the plot line? I'm really sure. I think I think we'll just talk to people. No. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition. Nobody but loves would you that. do Miss Grant a favor ass. and hear me out? Yeah. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all oh, around the that. campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. Fuck the no. Yes. Uh. I guess cameras could have helped Rachel. I can see both sides. You're fair minded, Max. And we all pray Rachel is found safe and sound, bless her soul. But this petition isn't about her. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage. From the Native Americans who founded this land, to the pioneers who shared it in peace. Not oh, fear and violence. Blackwell is that old? That's incredible. You should learn a little history about your alma mater. You'll find some fascinating facts. There's a lot of power in this region. I think it helps the creative juices flow around here. Creative now, before juices. I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. We got time. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? Hey. I'm not sure yet. I mean, he's clearly a genius, but I don't agree with everything he says. He does get a bit pretentious, but he's passionate and just says what he thinks. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. No way. You can get hey. him so busted. And he's not going to mess around with a student. That's what you think. Now, how do you know this? You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. What? Well, I heard that from a good source. So, you knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind of clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. And was this? Oh man. This day has been so insane. Cool. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this Power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason. And I have to find out why. You're the hero that Gotham needs. Oh, this is cool. I just. This is cool. Get up. Okay. I want to do the quadricopter thing. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? A weapon, right? Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny, Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Hi, Brooke. Let me... Is that really yours? Is that even legal? Of course. Nobody knows about it yet. Isn't it considered a weapon of war? 
Uh, you read too many cons- Sorry, Max. I have to focus on making sure this drone doesn't crash. Hi, Brooke. Let me get. I love- This is ne- A weapon. Uh, What a complicated name for such a tiny drone. Hi, Brooke. Let me... That looks like a high-fly drone. Model B400 EVO. Now, that's a nice piece of tech. You're full of surprises. Why would you know that? I love aerial photography. Drones are perfect for that, especially those with great range. It's a new era of images. Most impressive, Max. Warren said you were multifaceted. Here, give the drone a whirl around campus. Cool. Can I actually fly it or is it just... That is really cool. Oh man, does this just go on forever? The elliptic goes on forever. I bet David Madsen would love to spy on us with this kind of drone. Oh, yeah. Here, give the drone a whirl around campus. Oh, cool. So just go talk to her and, th and do it again. Cool. Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to Thrash? Oh, yeah? Bring it. What's your first move gonna be? Uh... Jump? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Yo, Justin. Check out the... I came to nose slide. But I'd love to see somebody do a tree flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Nah, I just can't skate worth shit. Aw, oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? Go for a tree flip. Let's get Trevor all over that action. Oh, oh man, that's gonna hurt. I'm stoked to see those photos framed and shit. You never really escape Betty, though. Escape Betty? I used to be, but I'm into my camera now. I can tell. We need more girls out here. Rachel Amber and her punk friend used to skate with us. Who was Rachel's punk friend? I can't remember her name. She was hot. Tats, blue hair, hardcore. She stopped hanging out with us after Rachel disappeared. <laughs> Ran away. You ever hang out with Victoria? Fuck that. I'd rather rollerblade than hang out with snobs like her. Oh my god. I'd rather rollerblade. Ugh. You knew Rachel? She used to chill with us sometimes. One day she just vanished. I hope she's living the dream somewhere. 
And if anybody hurt her, we'll get a skate posse and take them out with our boards. Oh man, he's... Let's chill later, Justin. Oh. Anytime you want to take some action shots, we're here for you, Max. Hi, Daniel. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. Rachel Amber. So what happened to her? There's gotta be a story. She just stopped coming to class. Some people said she ran away. Some say she jumped off a cliff. I just hope she's okay. You knew her? No, but once she asked me to draw her portrait. Oh, she was a natural. Hard to avoid her posters all over campus. Kills me to see her sweet face used as a crime photo. Ah, she had a good heart. Okay, why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. No way, you're a good substitute muse. Oh, that's a good posture. Good, good. Best portrait ever. She seems really unsure of that. Okay, let's go get the flash drive now. Here? Dormitory is okay. Wait, hold Wait. Evan's portfolio always looks so uber pro. I'd love to see his photos in there. Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous fallen soldier? Isn't it Robert Dorno? Oh my. You can't even tell the difference between street photography and photojournalism. No portfolio peak for you. Hey, Evan. Let's see if you're worthy. Gotta be Eugene Smith. Well, they both were famous war photographer images, but you should know the difference. Oh, you're a dick. Good try. Wrong answer. You're a dick. Hey, Evan. Let's see if you're worthy of it. Robert Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My, my. This quiet child knows things. That's why I'm here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? It's not it's a privilege creepy. I grant to many. I'd be honored, sir. I need to go there and grab Warren's flash drive. Come on, Logan, bring it, brah. Bring it, brah. Bro. Yeah. Dude. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Hey. Oh. Hi, Max. How are you doing? Fantastic. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. Pretty soon I'll be bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. I think you're better <laughs> off reading chiclet. Good point. Now if you'll excuse me. Sorry. 
I really have to find out what happens. Yeah. No, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. Yeah. Oh look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean oh. processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> a bitch. Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. So original. Okay. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh, yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. There goes Samuel da Vinci to paint the window. Nice, bro. I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones mm. incentive to beat it. So close. That was, that was an accident. Nice, bro. <gasps> what the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this. Jill, Victoria, it's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look... Great. I can't even chill on the steps. This is it. Nice. Oh, hi, Kate. I do. None shall pass. She looks like a pissed off wet cat, and she's still stylish. Damn, I missed something. I better rewind. Sorry, no paparazzi allowed. Okay, let's see if this works. Nice, bro. Let's see what happens. Maybe I don't even need to do the sprinkler at all. Maybe we'll just fall on her. I hope so, that'd be great. Paint all over her clothes. Oh my god. Close, but no cigar. They have to be right under the bucket. Let's see if this works. 
between. Yeah. Oh man, here we go. <laughs> oh, Sammy, I'm sorry. Wet paint is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. <laughs> hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. That was amazing. That was great. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. He looked down. You okay? I'm kind of over humanity today. Sorry to be a drama queen. Is there anything... Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. Well, it's okay. I can't really understand. I don't know if we all nice, understand. Bro. Nice, bro. I feel like Alyssa and I should be better friends. Sorry. I really have to find out what happens. Glad to see our campus is eco-friendly. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you yeah. want, Max? Mm. No, fuck it. I'm gonna make fun of her. He's a bitch. No. Don't say a word, Max. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. And no filter needed before I post this. Now please move. I've had a messed up day and I'm going to my room. You do that? I know where you live. So does Nathan. Ooh. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Now I have to get to my room, then see Warren. See what happens. Uh, I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was, but there will be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and, and the go fuck your selfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Au revoir. I don't know. Victoria probably played me. I should have played her. Better get to my room before I find Warren. No, no, fuck it. I'm just gonna be a dick to her because... She's so rude to everybody. And uh, she 100% deserves uh, it. 100%. Maybe yeah. I shouldn't have done that. No, no, we're, we're going to. No. We're going to live with these consequences because that was great and I feel great about it. Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. God. Uh, Taylor is a sleep. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly pathetic.
could be fun. I'm glad I'm not the only lonely nerd around here. Hmm. Thanks for the warning. At least that's an alarm from this century. Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. Oh, no teddy bear. Home sweet home. My favorite cocoon. Skill. But let's further some story plot. Oh. Um. Attitude and behavior. Not fitting well. That's. Whatever. I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. It's hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. I like my wardrobe. Yeah, be Would you. Man Ray call them selfie portraits? You be you. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of The October Country. I should have every Bradbury book for myself. Instant film is so damn hard to find and expensive now. But I... Or the plan. You are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mama. Drink up. Wait, why is it gonna have action? If I'm not yeah. looking through a viewfinder, I'm looking through a window. Always looking. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. <sighs> Max and Chloe. Best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Oh, it's okay, Max. I don't... I really want to play the music, but I don't want to get flagged for... I don't want to get flagged for just playing copyrighted music, you know? So cheesy, but... It makes me smile thinking of the day Mom and I sewed that together. I look so pathetic. Daniel has so much her. talent. I hope nobody hates on it just because it's me. I am so addicted to this site. <laughs> look at these vintage beauties. Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. How does the camera work? Oh man. 
Man, I love the reflection. Reflections in this game. Amazing. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. When I swallowed your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER, I knew we were bonded forever. <laughs> Perfect kid. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. And. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. So stupid. Hey, Juliet, is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. What did you she do? Ridiculous. What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You, you never talk. Just scream. zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Uh, Juliet Mason. That was truly sad. Thanks Aww. for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Oh, that was my second. Uh, that was my second choice. Hey, Juliet. Oh yes, Max. Juliet, this is so stupid. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Uh, of course I do. Thanks. I locked Dana you in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. Would Dana do that? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext. And Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't do anything. But I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. Ooh, gonna go look around in Victoria's room. Yeah. Oh, man. Sneaking around. Dior, Givenchy, you... Those boots are made for walking runways. That is a tasty plasma. Maybe I could sneak in and watch Final Fantasy Spirits Within. I bet Victoria put Juliet on her shit list after this article. Hmm. Victoria is a real Jefferson groupie. Yeah. Maybe it's on our computer. That's real nice, Victoria. And who the hell thinks I'm a hipster? Boom! This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Wow, Victoria's such a bitch. Every single, everything that I do to her from now on out is just gonna be, just be a dick to her, 100%, because she's, deserves all, all of it. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. Printer would be great. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Oh, <laughs> 
Obvious, but true. Ah! Juliet, read this. Of course! Yeah, Victoria's a bitch. Why would you believe anything Victoria says? I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. <laughs> Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my How own do you room. Lock... Real mature. I don't think you can actually do that. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though, Warren obviously likes hanging with you. Yeah, he does. Okay. He's a good guy. A geek like me. You saw the files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy shit. Films I've never even heard of. And in a special folder called Max. Yeah, okay. I gotcha. Are you blushing? <laughs> Go ahead and grab the flash drive whenever. I don't know. How can you answer that question when you're not fucking looking at me? This is both sad and pathetic. Oh, what? It would be a cool sticker without the words. Oh, uh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Oh, man. Get up, you nice, fix Max. Things. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. But I could rewind and make it up to her. Hey, Dana. Dana, I'm not trying to be nosy, but... I heard a rumor about you. What? Who told you I was pregnant? Nobody important. They just acted like it was bullshit. I just wanted you to know. It's like a goddamn reality show around here. Can you keep a secret, Max? Of course. I... was pregnant. Was. Oh. What? What about the other... Deadbeat Dad? You can catch him on the 40-yard line this Friday. And it's not Zachary. Who then? And you don't have to tell me. In fact, you better not. I like your spirit, Max. Anyway, you better get that flash drive so Warren has an excuse to bug you. Oh. Must protect my precious, so Max never has to chase it down again. <laughs> oh my god, that was great. Intense though. We're in. What? You can count all the cars. <laughs> you know, I actually like Warren. I've seen some of the people who play this, they, they don't like Warren, but I, 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 he's alright. Fuck this shit! Ow! Damn, I better rewind. Ow! Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. Max, that was awesome. Thank you. 
No problem. You have quick reflexes. Years of mad dodging skills. Well, these never change. Oh. That's why you're better off. You're smart. We should hang out more. Now I have to finish this stupid book. No, I understand. Whenever you start a book, and even if you don't like it, even if you hate it, you have to finish it because it's just... The Prescott Dormitory? Good uh, lord, Nathan's family owns my dorm? You have to finish it, you know? So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Intervene. Fuck you. Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. Oh, fuck off. Go oh, fuck yourself, E. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. Yeah. I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. Maybe I should rewind and mind my own business? <laughs>